is the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. That's the way we do it. No name. Read it, brother. Verse 9. Simon Peter saith unto him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head. God told Peter, if you don't get his feet washed, you will have nothing to do with it. That's, that's it. You just ready to get ready for him. Peter got the understanding of it. Peter said, Lord, not on my feet. Just wash my feet. You know what? Get my head too. So I want to make sure I make it easy. Now mind you, I've got, he was just only washing feet. Now Peter, once he told Peter that he won't, if he don't get his feet washed, he's going to lose up. Read that, read that what Peter said again. Peter, we're, going, we're reading from John, the 13th chapter, where verse 8. Peter said unto him, Thou shalt never wash my feet. Jesus answered him, If I wash thee not, thou hast no part with me. No part. No part. Anytime someone tells you you have no part, you can't be with him. Amen. Otherwise, you can't come to him. You can't go to heaven with him. No part in this matter. Somebody stepped this up, got a meeting or whatever, somebody said, you have no part in here. That means for you to love it. Get out of here. You can't come in here. Amen. And Peter got that understanding. Repeat it. I'm going to rehearse it. Peter said unto him, Thou shalt never wash my feet. Jesus answered him, If I wash thee not, thou hast no part with me. Mm -hmm. Simon Peter said unto him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head. So Lord, then do me this. Just, just, just go ahead and put it, put it extra mile. Hand, head. Otherwise, you can just give me a shout. Amen. Amen. Because I want to make it easy. See, read on, brother. Read from John, the 13th chapter, where verse 10. Jesus saith to him, He that is washed needeth not save to wash his feet, but is clean every whit, and ye are clean, but not all. But not all. Mm -hmm. For he knew who should betray him. Therefore said he, Ye are not all clean. Oh, Judah got his feet washed too. Amen. Yes, sir. See, you weren't all clean, but I did wash your feet anyway. But I know, I know you're the devil. I wash your feet. Read on. We're reading from John the 13th chapter, at verse 12. So after he had washed their feet and had taken his garments and was set down again, he said unto them, Know ye what I have done to you? Uh huh. Verse 13. Ye call me master and lord. And ye say, well, for so I am. You know something? If I then... You better get it out. You better hear this out there when I answer that. Verse 14 of the 13th chapter of John. If I then, your Lord, Lord and, master, and Master, have washed your feet, ye also ought to wash one another's feet. Jesus, I did it for you. I washed your feet. So by all means, you ought to wash one another feet. So don't tell me that the big shot bitcher that you don't have time to wash feet. You, you, you don't have time to go to hell. You have no part with God. You have no part. If you don't have no part with Jesus, you know you're not having no part with God because that's God's name, Jesus. Amen. 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 Who do you think is speaking? Jesus. God is speaking and his name is Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah Jesus. to God. The Son of God. Read my brother. Verse 15. For I have given you an example that you should do as I have done to you. He gives us an example. We go to church all we want to and we don't do this here. We just lose the time. That go for the preach all the way back to the earth. Amen. Lose the time. Read my brother. John the 13th chapter at verse 16. Verily, verily, I say unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord, neither he that is sent greater than he that sent him. Mm -hmm. If ye know these things, happy are ye if ye do them. See, if you know these things, happy are ye if you do them. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Go over here, back over here. We go to a place where people don't like to go. Me to go to Isaiah 9.14. Oh, I know you're going to come up there by the old hill. Yeah, you can call it old hill, because it's been old. It's been there going a long time. We're reading from 
from Isaiah, the ninth chapter, beginning with the 14th verse. Therefore, the Lord... Oh, it's 14 now. 14 now, right. 14 now. No, no, 14. I said, I said, I said it. We're reading from Isaiah, the 14th chapter, the ninth verse. Hell from beneath is moved for thee to meet thee at thy coming. You want to go there? Is stirred. I don't want to go there myself. So you got to do something. See all this, all, all this screaming, reading, and I've been doing my best to explain it. We got to do it. We have to do it. You want to go to hell? And if we don't do it, there's another place for us. Amen. It's either heaven or hell. Amen. Now, people love to talk about heaven. Oh, heaven. Oh, yeah. Oh, isn't that heavenly? Oh, it's so beautiful. But you don't want to hear nothing about hell. No. See, that's how the devil is. He don't, want you to be, he don't want you to get wise to hell. So you're already there. Right. Then when you get in there, where am I at? Get in here, you fool, you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Meet you. Mm -hmm. Hell from the knees. You want to know it? Hell is above and hell is down there. The knees us. Is moved for thee to meet the air. Hell can move. move. Right. Amen. Amen, really. It stirred up the dead for thee. The hell going to meet you. Had you fallen at your soul, falling out. The hell going to be out there to meet you. You ever see a great fish? I jump up there, you see something? You jump, reach up the grass. Back down. Amen. Do your favor. You do your favor. Really. Even all the chief ones of the earth. You ever say, stir us up? It stirred up the dead for thee. You know, down in there right now, there's a lot of stirring going on inside that pot. Just a bubbling. Just a bubbling. Bubbling with whatever she's cooking in there. But stir us up the dead for thee. Even all the chief ones of the earth. You can hear them hollering and screaming and gnashing of teeth. Can you imagine hearing a million of people out there calling and crying and gnashing of teeth? What a sound that would make. Amen. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people down in hell, you know. And a lot more going back down in there. Go on, go on. They're falling down there right now. One going. Amen. 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 Hallelujah to God. Read. It hath raised up from their thrones all the kings of the nation. All the kings. You walk around with the royal robes, the best of silks, and all wrapped up like a, like a, like a rainbow. But you know what? Hallelujah to God. Down in hell. That's right. All the chief ones. Down in hell. All the little dead presidents gone down there too. Look out of bomb. You believe in abortion. You've got a good ticket for hell. Amen. Mm. Amen. Abortion. Yeah. Jesus. You for abortion. And homosexuals. You go, oh yeah. Amen. Don't speak out on that. Obama, you the candidate. Amen. Unless you repent of it. Yeah, That's right. Amen. Let me tell you. Amen. Yeah, he got his wife and, and not two beautiful daughters there and everything. And here you go yourself for abortion. Yeah. You tell yeah. the people to kill the babies. Jesus. Amen. Like, you know, oh, you think about it. To oh, kill the baby. God. I heard somebody say the, the most horrible thing, place, uh, 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 the most horrible place for anyone is to be in the mother room. Amen. The most horrible place to be. Why? Why would you say that? To be in a mother warm in those horrible place. Because the enemy don't know whether to be sucked out by the head and that in abortion. Amen. Amen. Thank God for the one that come out normal, natural, like it's supposed to be. Hey, you know, you're not married, you know, you know, you, 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 you can talk, people gotta talk about you. And let them talk. Have your baby. I, I'm, 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 I'm not so now. Amen. Thank you. But let them talk. Thank you, Lord. Don't you take your child. Let them. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I don't want to be embarrassed. I don't want to see my stomach sticking out. <laughs> Go ahead and let your stomach hang all the way out. Amen. Hang over till you about to fall over. <laughs> don't, don't you go to that boy's place. <laughs> I'm serious about that. I'm out here now. Amen. 
Amen. Amen. You didn't have your little children. You look at them. You're not happy that you didn't mention the phone you could have Look what you could have been going. Look what you could have been going yourself getting rid of. Your God would be out of your mind. And yet, anyone do it is out of your mind when they're doing that. That's right. Amen. You could be out of your mind right. thinking like you, just me, 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 me. Go ahead and get that abortion. abortion. Next thing you know, right back again, call. Not a portion coming up. I don't have the money for this one. And most men, you know, make a drive you to do it too. Because they look, they look at that whole thing. I got some focus in there. I got my job. No, I've been missing money. Look how the money be coming out there to me. So I don't know what I'm going to tell them. I'm mad. But I'm not right there. Just a happy when you're doing it. When you're doing it. Now you're angry now. Yeah. It's not mine. It's not mine. Not mine. You know, men is a terrible thing. be a terrible Amen. thing. You know what I mean? Us men is something else, you know. Amen. It's the devilish thing we can be. Amen. 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 Yeah. Finish that out. I'll take the time yet. Yeah, all they, all they shall speak and say unto thee, Art thou also become weak as we? You got some good people in hell. Are thou become like unto us? Amen. Thy pomp is brought down right. to the grave. All right. We got to, I can go back there over this again. Amen. Yeah, so the needs is move. To meet you as you come. I think our time has expired. Please, Lord, don't let me die in my head and I end up in hell. Yeah. I don't want to go down there. Hell is deep. Hell is wide. Hell won't have no bar beside. Please, I don't want to go down there. But you have to do something to, 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 uh, to keep from going there. You have to deny yourself. You have to take up the cross. And there can be things thrown at you all constantly. You get hit all sides of here. Yep. You can get hit in tender spots. But that's all it's going to take all that and more too. Amen.